Hello everyone and welcome back to World of Warship and I've been thinking to share with you my personal opinion about the new captain which is pretty darn good for the new oncoming British heavy cruisers and that it's Jack Dunkirk. I do believe I received this captain for free, of course it was never a 19 points captain but it was, I do believe it's some um, missions many 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 uh, years ago uh, it was a Dunkirk mission and I do believe you received this captain for free um, if you complete the missions. Now what's a special about this captain it's definitely better expert mark, uh, markman and also jack of all trades. I would like to say for the British uh, heavy cruiser my suggestion there is a uh, some uh, specific build but remember they do have hill hydro and uh, spotter planes at lower tier so you definitely need all your help to the biggest downside with the uh, British heavy cruiser or the range you have great concealment uh, but you kind of a lack in range so range is everything and I'll also talk what kind of hydro and what kind of special um, uh, equipment you would need to purchase if you want to have a really good uh, captain so my number one it's priority target the second one um, especially the mid tier and the low tier the expert mark it's a must because they are slug uh, my Belfast my Fiji all they need those expert mark otherwise it's very mech and for the third one this is absolutely a must be superintendent for additional heal additional spotter plane additional hydro and so on so this is absolutely a must and also a must concealment because at tier 8 i do believe and probably also tier uh, 7 you have one of the best concealed uh, cruiser in this game yes you are a super cruiser or a heavy cruiser with the best concealment absolutely broken i do believe some ships they have so low or slightly above 10 km which is fantastic now after this uh, 10 points you may actually um, take adrenaline rush but also this pick it's not bad jack of all trades it's also very nice but before I do that I would like to say that this expert loader it's not a bad choice remember guys that you have a, a tier uh, 8, 9, 10 very big caliber guns and you probably want to use your AP not just the HE so expert loader it's um, a must have skill at tier 9 and 10 that's what I'm trying to say um, after that because it's it is a different kind of build guys you don't really need additional uh, percent to put you anywhere far. You have one of the highest. And same story with Vigilant. You have very good um, Hydro. I, I believe, guys, without saying too much, that sure, you can have it. It's not bad pick, but it's nothing that I recommend. I do not uh, recommend either IFA cheat for the tier 9 and 10, but probably for tier... Um, five all the way to tier uh, eight it's not bad ifhe but the concealment it's this perk i do not highly recommend because it's lost its power frankly it really did um so once again guys uh, over here it's a little bit confused which one i uh, i uh, would like to recommend you but definitely buff everything you got with your consumable uh, faster heal uh, faster uh, reload of those uh, hydro and this perk together with this one with high alert it's not a bad choice and same story with jack of all trades so no i'm, ta I'm talking about uh, uh, jack of all trades instead of this one so let me know guys in a comment below something else and let's go for artery this is extremely important remember guys and this is a uh, kind of a, a must have module uh, your range or a limitation you have one of the crappiest r range at tier 7 tier 6 and uh, guys even a tier 8 you do not have any good range 
uh, your range is absolutely crap. A matter of fact, you have one of the um, um, shortest range of any cruiser. Seriously, this is not a joke. And for that reason, guys, we are going for upgrades. Which uh, upgrades do I recommend? It's actually spotter aircraft modification one and hydro. You do not have uh, anything else for the um, uh, British heavy cruiser, but definitely you have hydro action time of course almost 20 percent but main the main thing i highly recommend is this one if i press this is said it's uh available for tier 6 to tier 10 battleships and cruiser with a spotting aircraft consumable you kind of need to have this guys really this uh, for me I definitely will purchase there's a lot of mission going on I have a crazy lo loud uh, coal I don't even need to use the any coupons but guys if I will play a British heavy cruiser this is a must-have uh, because of the extremely short range you do you know what I mean so let me know guys in a comment below uh, did i missed something do you think that is another upgrade that it's better than the um, uh, spotting aircraft modification and the hydro search yeah it says here from tier 6 to tier 10 uh, hydro search consumable gives you plus 20 percent in action time you have stock 100 seconds so because guys you are kind of a close and you are not a dpm monster but you are um, uh, one salvo can do huge amount of damage you probably are closer than many other uh, cruisers so it's not a bad choice this one uh, but i definitely prefer uh, the um, uh, the spotter plane uh, but also this one it's, it's a good one so guys let me know in a comment below which recommendation do do you give to the community and all those uh, player who wants to grind the new um, the new british heavy cruiser line have a good one guys take care and bye